Time for the upset punch. We're gonna show you the red belt version, the one that appears in a Chung Jung 2 red belt form, and we're gonna show you the one that appears in uh, first degree black belt form, which is upwards to the chin. So, first thing we're gonna cover though, in blue belt form, the first time we ran into upset punches was the second move. The looks lucky was twin upset punch, face down, twist in. So, we learned that the hands start facing down, and they make a straight line of their target and twist in. We learned that in blue. But because it was both hands, we didn't turn the shoulders. That's what's gonna change now. So, in red, after that double inner form block, this hand starts face down, and it makes a straight line and twists up to the solar plexus. But, because this is not a twin like blue belt, I can let my hip and my shoulder play the game. So after this technique, again, hand starts face down, Reaction force hand goes, straight line, and get some shoulder to it. Boom. Now, one more tip. Do not overextend this. It's not what it's meant to do. My punch can go a long distance, but the upset punch is meant to hang out just a little bit closer. There's more power when the elbow is close than when it's extended. So, face down, go, 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 and twist. Face up. That's a tech breakdown of the upset punch. But now let's cover the first degree black belt version. So first, move a first degree black belt form. I step and I do a double inner form block. Now this one is gonna go up in the chin. Again, face down, twist on the way there. Face down, elbow goes, twist. So here, boom. But it's the same concept. It fires from here, the elbow stays behind it, it twists through the target and it retracts afterwards. So, red belt, first degree black belt. Red belt slow motion, first degree black belt slow motion. All right, that's the single upset punch for you or the upwards upset punch. Go practice.